How's it going guys? We're here to check out the skins that made it in this week and we're gonna start out with some gloves. So we've got the No Mercy gloves. We got the boots last week and uh, no gloves. Well, this week we've got the gloves. They'll be running you 199, so a little bit more than usual. And uh, they have everything that you would expect with the signature set. It's got that skull right there and the nice clean black and white with the black pads and the white knuckles. Definitely that one last thing you need to complete that set. Next, we've got another armor set for you and it's a continuation in the bombing set. So we've got the hoodie and pants last time and now we've got the metal HQ. The straps look like they're made out of some kind of old leather. The whole thing is just kind of graffitied up you got loot or die, various other things, anarchy symbols, armored king, you know, all that kind of stuff. Some little devil horns. It looks like a bullet is either still in there or that's a bullet, you know, bullet dent, I would say. Back here, you've got a big old warning sign, a skull, a bloody handprint, and a few other things. Definitely a cool set, and the hooding pants did really well, so I'll see this doing quite well as well. As well, as well, 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 saying well so many times. Next up, we've got the deployables for you this week. Starting out, we've got this cute little weather chest right here. It's going to cost you the usual 149 It's a continuation in the set now. You've got the creepy little eyes here on the keyhole, some uh, various uh, personalities going on with the clouds. Over here, same thing, we've got some water droplets and lightning. Big old rainbow up here. And it makes on this side again. And then on the very back, you've got these snowflakes. So definitely a cool little box, for sure. Moving along, we've got a new vending machine, and it is the recycler vending machine. This guy will run you the usual 149. And the whole thing is just mocked up to look like a recycler, and it has like a recycle here. I don't know if you guys have ever seen like a recycling machine. There's these can machines here that you can actually come and stick cans or beer bottles, wine bottles, uh, jugs, stuff like that. And it counts them and then recycles them. Then you can get cash or like a voucher for a grocery store that's like connected to it or something. There's, there's you know, one of those kind of things. So I think that's kind of what the inspiration behind this was. It's definitely kind of a really cool idea. You can see there's some little like drop areas on the side. Definitely neat. We'll go ahead and take a look-see at the back of it. And it pretty much just has a big recycler symbol and it continues that color scheme. No special lights or anything. Moving on, we've got a double door for you. It looks like the pixel set is back because we've got the pixel double door. This one is going to be the more expensive one this week, running you at $2.99. Still not as bad as some of the other pieces in the Pixel set, so probably a good grab. And uh, this just has that nice simple look where it's just uh, pixelated, uh, almost like uh, Rust is being Minecraftized or something. Or, you know, bringing it back to the retro days of gaming. We'll go ahead and take a look at it here. Both sides, but, you know, with the sheet metal doors, both sides are identical. And, like I said, here is the front of the vending machine for the lights. Nothing really going on the sides. As I said, nothing going on in the back. And then apparently we have a thunderstorm. Alright, lastly, we've got two weapons for you this week, starting out with this bow. So, we've got this whole kind of, like, moon knight kind of uh, look to it. And it, of course, then is aptly named the Rising Moon Bow. It's going to run you the usual 199. Go ahead and draw an arrow into it. Do a little spin around. See the light hit it differently. And there you have it. And lastly, we've got a new LR for you. The Doodle LR has made it in. This is quite the upgrade from its old version and it uh, looks like Hulk probably noticed that. And it is only going to run you the usual 199 weapon price. So that is nice. There's lots of red highlights added to it. Like aiming down the site here, you can see the red painted sites, not glow. A engraved little like crazy creature, wolf, monster skull thing going on. 
You got your little Rust HQ guy hanging out on the side. There's all sorts of little details the more you look at this gun, and it's uh, definitely really, really cool. Go ahead and pop a reload. And there you have it. All right, guys, that does it. So which ones are you going to pick up this week and why? And give any kind of feedback you can. I'll try to get to the right people, as always. Thanks for watching, and I hope you guys have a great one. There's going to be some cool stuff coming up for the holiday season. I'll be covering that in either a video later today or tomorrow, depending, because I'm still waiting for one more item to pop up. We'll just see how that goes. Keep an eye out for that. Thanks for watching, guys. Have a good one.